Just a minute. I said just a minute. Go ahead. Holy! <laughs> we were talking about this vision of these two cute little kids on, on one of those um, fit, fit, you know, fitness machines. <laughs> Uh, I wouldn't mind being able to sit on a vibrator like that and, you know, have a laugh. Oh, you know what I'm saying. No, it's okay. Right, like okay. <laughs> Welcome to the world's funniest weather. I know what you're thinking. Weather's not funny. Well, you know what? Let's see if we can change your mind. Hey, everybody. On really windy days like this, I always make sure everything outside my house is safely tied down. This is in my house. Megan, grab that umbrella as well. You're going to need your umbrella all week long. Winds will start to pick up as we head into those afternoon hours. And then as we head into the evening. <laughs> you can see we still continue to watch some rain chances. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Um, when we move into tomorrow, we're back to those lower 50s. <laughs> we were talking about this vision of these two cute little kids on, on one of those um, fit, fit, you know, fitness machines. Uh, I, I wouldn't mind being able to sit on a vibrator like that and, you know, have a laugh. Oh, you know what I'm saying. No, that's it. What we can expect as we make our way into your day is we're going to have the colliding sea breeze coming in on both locations. See what happens as you have the land. Whoa! That was a first. Wow, how it about really that? It really is Friday, isn't it? Yeah, I guess so. Well, the wind, as I was talking to it was so strong, it actually just pushed the clicker out of my hands. Sam, hopefully uh, Sam is going to have my back on this one. Sam Freeman. All right, and Yahtzee. Photojournalist Andy Wilkins takes us to the grand opening of the new locally owned Infinity Store right here in Huntsville. It was a wild opening at the Affinity Place. You wouldn't believe the party they had. Who doesn't love the sight of fresh snow on a rooftop? Maybe the people standing below it.
okay. Coming up, find out why Timmy got grounded for three months. <laughs> and then... Uh, Be on TV. Oh, this sucks! Everybody's a critic. The weather's warm and the family is gathered for all sorts of backyard fun. Nothing can ruin this day. Well, almost nothing. Summertime rolls around, people hit the water. But as you'll see, not always on purpose. Vamos. Animal. Come on. Get on it. I'm so scared. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm so scared. Stop. Push it. Oh, my God. <laughs> What's this happening? Next, I'd like to emphasize the importance of keeping your footing when out in nature. Next, I'd like to emphasize the importance of keeping your footing when out in nature. Beautiful. That's it. Keep, keep it natural. Gorgeous. Yes, I love that. Perfect. Just take a step to your... Whoa, whoa! Just hold on, Sean. Yes! 
No way. No way. <laughs> How'd that go, Sean? Coming up, how a bear named Cinnamon put herself through college. <laughs> it's one hairy stripper. Just get the idea to build the city's first underground parking garage. 1955, Wichita, Kansas. For the 10th year in a row, the Slapnik brothers accurately predict an early fall. 1958, Cambridge, Massachusetts. Scientists use the first non-human study group to predict the severity of cold and flu season. And in 1962, Macon, Georgia, teenage scientists test the very first steel radial weather satellite. That was this week in weather history. If you're a bear, the end of winter means it's time to come out of hibernation, find some food, and maybe get into a little trouble. Like, well, this. Oh my god, he's in the car. <laughs> He got in the car. What? Oh my God! <laughs> He's in the <laughs> car. Oh, I'm cussing. I'm, I'm cussing all night. <laughs> Close the door. Just a minute. I said just a minute. Did you close the gate? I think so. Better think again. Take a look. Oh, crap! Yes, this is a bear. This is a bear. Going near the Oh, my gosh. Hey, buddy. You want to come in? Oh, my gosh. He is nibbling. <gasps> <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> it's one hairy stripper. <laughs> I'd like to emphasize the importance of keeping your footing when out in nature. Next, I'd like to emphasize the importance of keeping your footing when out in nature. Number two. We were talking about this vision of these two cute little kids on, on one of those um, fit, fit, <laughs> you know, fitness machines. I wouldn't mind being able to sit on a vibrator like that and, you know, have a laugh. Oh, you know what I'm saying. Right. And here's my personal favorite, number one. <laughs> one hairy 
stripper. <laughs> She must be a polar bear. <laughs> now come on, go to our website, Facebook page, Instagram, Twitter, or YouTube channel, and tell us which one you like best. And hey, if you have a funny weather clip of your own, upload it. If we use it, there's a 100% chance we'll throw you some cash. And how fun is that? <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Jody Miller, and this is the world's funniest weather.